about you and me All the possibilities that couldn't be Isn't me or are we not meant to be I was feeling you so much but now I finally see Welcome to You Heard It From Z where you get all the tea And the tea today is why you should never make permanent decisions with temporary people But before we get into this video please subscribe right now why you should never make permanent decisions with temporary people please stay tuned number one on why you should never make permanent decisions with temporary people is because they're there for a good time not a long time and i'm speaking on relationships when i say this situationships are good time not long times seeing what we can do is good time not long times going with the flow is good time not long time you do not make permanent decisions with those type of relationships with those type of titles okay and even if you're just even one year into the relationship don't make a permanent decision on a temporary person because a year is temporary as well a year goes by so fast okay and i'm not saying it cannot last i'm not trying to be the negative nasty i'm just letting you know the reason reality of things and I just want everybody to be prepared if something does not work out you get what I'm saying so let's not do permanent things like uh I know pregnancies you know happen but we don't want to make pregnancies a thing you know that we do for somebody because we were so in love with them for about four months and then all of a sudden now he's you're just the baby mom and he's just the baby we don't want those type of situations okay that's a good time not long time and until you can see that it's going for a long term do not take it that serious do not put no permanent title on that all right so number one on why you should never make a permanent uh decision on a temporary uh people is it's a good time not long time number two on why you should never make permanent decisions with temporary people is because you're missing your blessing okay so say if you're so in love you're so starstruck by this human being and you just don't see nobody else you can't see nobody else and say if he's not putting a title or she's not putting a title on it it's a good time not a long time but you really like this person and you really want to see where it's going but at the end of the day when you make those permanent decisions like i want him that's who i'm going to be with i want her that's who i'm going to be with no matter what i have to go through you're going to be missing your blessing and your blessing could be sitting right next to you like right there over there over there over there over there you're wasting your time we're not making permanent decisions with temporary people that was temporary it was a situation ship it was a this it was a that it wasn't a relationship because if it was the case you know you wouldn't be you know you know what i'm saying so don't miss your blessing because you making permanent decisions with people and I just say this like it could be anything it really could be anything like think of a time where you was in a relationship and you made sure that this was the person that was going to be for this this and that and you didn't know for sure like where y'all was headed where y'all was going you didn't know if y'all was solid or not but you still made that decision to be dedicated to that person that person only and then when you finally got away which probably two or three years from that time period you seen what the reality was and you got what god wanted for you which is that person that job that this that that don't make no permanent decision on no temporary person you're gonna miss your blessing so number two is you're gonna miss your blessing Number three on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people is because it's a setback, all right? So say if you're moving at a steady place, you know where you want to be in life, you know what I'm saying? And then you steady have this person over here that's confusing you. Your mind is going all over the place when it comes to them. They say, I just want to see where it's going. Y'all have this situation ship, but y'all have this relationship on top of that. That is a setback, okay? That is a temporary person. Do not take that serious. Do not make that permanent, okay? That person do not need to stay in your life. That's for good time, not long time, like number one. That person is only in your life to maybe just to give you a lesson, show you a lesson. Because, you know, I feel like every relationship, you get lessons and blessings out of them, okay? You always have a lesson out of your first, your second, your third, your, first, your fourth break, breakup. You get what I'm saying? You always learn something from your situationships, your relationships, you know, your DEA appointments. Like, you always know, get a, um, a lesson out of them, okay? And I feel like those good times, not long times, are setbacks. Don't make no permanent decision with somebody uh, that's temporary because that is a setback. For you moving on to that next person, that is going to be a lifetime. Sometimes a setback can really have a toll 
on your life. And I'm not saying that, you know, mistakes don't happen, but if we can, if we can maneuver through that, learn from other people's mistakes and just keep learning on the way, you will be fine. But you have to not let a temporary decision hold you back. So um, number three on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people is because it's a setback. Number four on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people because feelings change. And this is the sad part about, you know, getting to know somebody in a situation, going with the flow. You get what I'm saying? Feelings do change. And I mean, sometimes they tell your friend, you know, I want to see where this is going. If I see you in this type of light or however it might be, but feelings do change. And that's the reality of it. So why would you make you know, a permanent decision with a temporary person and their feelings are changing after three or four months of y'all even talking. And that's just a lot for you to go through. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of people be like, let your guard down, let your guard down, but you got to know when and who to let your guard down for. Okay. So, um, number four on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people is feelings change. Number five on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people. And I know y'all hate when I do these short, simple videos, but I got to keep it short, simple, and cute. You already know. But number five on why you should never make a permanent decision with temporary people is live life. Why would you want to make a permanent decision with somebody temporary? Why would you want to set your life back because you so focused on and dealing with this person that now, you know, you are set back from what you, what, what God has destined for you or what, you know, what you got destined for you. Stop setting yourself back and stop not living your life because you want to make permanent decisions with temporary people because you're going to go back into, you know, your life when you get older. You're going to be like, why did I waste all that time on somebody that didn't even see me? being with them in the future or I didn't even see you know myself being in the future and I know sometimes we do stuff because we bored and we just want to do it just because it's you know it's fun or it's entertaining in that time period but sometimes when you use stuff like that for convenience you, it can turn out really 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 bad so make sure that you using your time wisely when it comes to people when you put in stuff when you having situationships or you don't know what type of relationship you're really having with this person you don't take it that seriously you always know in the back of your head to think like this when you're dealing with this type of person and think like that and that's one thing that women girls we have to understand if we know that this right here is a situationship you need to treat it like that. You can't treat a situationship like a relationship. You just can't do that because then you'll be making permanent decisions with both of them. And we can't have that. No, one of them got to be temporary. And we know which one. Okay. So, um, don't make, you know, live your life. We're young. You know, I'm 23. I'm young. I'm living my life. I'm having fun. I'm experimenting with my hair and just finding out more about myself, learning myself out more. Cause you know, when the time is right for you to make a permanent decision with somebody, it's gonna hit you on your face and you, you're you gonna be able to not run from it. You're gonna see it how it comes. You're not gonna be guessing and, oh, I wonder if he's the one or, oh, I wonder if she's the one. You're gonna know because of how that person is treating you and how they're coming and approaching you, okay? So um, that was number five. If y'all like this video, um, y'all tell me if y'all made any permanent decisions with temporary people in the comments and what did you do to overcome them, all right? And um, I do have more videos coming up for you. And I hope y'all like my channel and I thank everybody that been subscribing. And yes, I'm up to 200 subscribers, which is not that much, but it's cool. Like, I like it. I can see that people are really, you know, messing with me and I, I just feel in the love and I really appreciate everybody that is on this journey with me. So, um, yeah, that was number five and I will see y'all in my next video. I'm moving on.